Hi everyone, welcome to Paul's Workshop. One of the things I've been trying to figure out lately is how to make my bandsaw mobile. I don't really want to put wheels underneath it because when I'm using it, I would prefer it to be sitting flat on the floor. I haven't really come up with a great idea how to do this until a woodworking buddy of mine on a local website came up with this brilliant idea, what he calls basically it's just a box. You plug the exhaust of your shop vac into the port and it comes out all the holes on the bottom of a pegboard and it creates a cushion of air and makes it float making things move around the floor. Let me show you first how I built it and then we'll get into the details.
Well, now that you've seen how it's built, let's get into a little more detail. Shop back exhaust port goes into the coupler, fills up the box with basically compressed air, goes through the eight holes that were in the bottom of the three quarter inch plywood, filling up the void in between the plywood and the pegboard, forcing all the air out the tiny little holes. The weather stripping that goes around is actually quite important. It's actually 3 8 7 inch thick, so it stands proud of the base. That in itself keeps the air bubble, um, slows it from dissipating, so it maintains this bubble underneath the pad and raises it up off the floor. It also would probably help keep the dust down that's on the floor and uh, won't uh, bring it up into the air. So, the whole thing was built with 3 quarter inch plywood and 1 quarter inch pegboard. And that's basically it. So, let's put this bad boy underneath the bandsaw and see if it actually works. Okay, I got the base underneath my bandsaw. It's not bolted in in any way, it's just sitting flat on top. Um, pretty solid, doesn't move. Um, now, the black uh, vent, uh, the black uh, adapter that I put on the top of the box, I placed it a little more forward so I can put my hose of my shop vac right through the hole at the front. So I'm going to go and get that. It doesn't lock in, it just sits there. That's it. So I'm going to, uh, for safety reasons, I'm going to um, connect a foot switch to my shop vac and uh, so I can operate it from over here. Just in case something happens, I can shut it off real quick. Okay? And I'm also going to put on some uh, ear protection. So let's try that out. So, uh... Thank you very much for watching and uh, I'll keep you posted on my next one.